so here is the eye of Ada just coming off the north coast of Cuba this little green dot is where we are red is pretty high winds redder is higher winds this is Andros uh, and as we play through this you will see how the wind develops into more red and up where we are up around 30 knots of wind is expected by 4 p.m. today you see the eye of the storm coming close to I think it's called Andros um, so we are caught up in the outer bands of it here by the prediction and then it eventually moves off a little bit so again this is now right there and as it goes and by the end of today we should be back down to 25 knot winds and the eye of the storm will be over headed towards uh, the Florida Keys hopefully we're going to be on the edge of it and it's going to go as predicted and not continue to the northeast it's going to take a turn towards the northwest um, and it will stay on the other side of the big island here in the Bahamas and we will be in the outer bands uh, relatively safe we are currently sheltered in an area protected from the direction of the winds we are right here and the winds are projected to come from this direction and this direction so we are sitting right here Oh, there we are. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Um, protected from this direction and this direction, which is the prevailing winds. Uh, there's about six other boats in this little area that have sought shelter here. Uh, the winds are currently about 25 knots, gusting to about 30. We expect them to reach about 30 knots sustained, probably gusting to 35 uh, later today and then hopefully to start to calm down around 4 p.m. today, but still pretty breezy. And we shouldn't get any surge or any waves because we've got land all around us and protecting our fetch. fetch. We have very, so we don't have a tense fetch. We have very small fetch, unlike out there. As you can see... The white caps. And it's got time and distance so it's got a very small distance to build waves so we don't have any waves but look over there and you can see waves crashing on the rock because it's yeah. got mm. a much further distance to put so that's a hurricane great that's what a hurricane looks like this is what being on the edge of a hurricane looks like sunset <laughs> sunset <laughs> Hurricane prep. And hurricane laundry. And hurricane laundry, prep hurricane and laundry. Prep. So the hurricane can fresh water rinse my clothes. <laughs> it's Tia. Me. finished making the boat hurricane ready. Cap has a backup bridle on in case worst comes to worst. Hey Cap. Hey. We also have these lines ready and available. Yep. Dingy's still here. 
it around front. Checking on the bridle now. I'm glad we have a second bridle. You can see how strong the wind is pulling the boat this way and that.